A pair of documentary makers have gone in search of the aurora borealis in Norway as they look to make a short film about the science behind the northern lights. Francisco Matos and Pa Lund have made their way to one of the most northern places in the world, which can boast a permanent human population. The pair have spent most nights heading up high into the mountains in search of locations where they can film time-lapse footage. I really want to make a movie that people are going to see all over the world and understand better where Northern Lights are. Because Northern Lights, are, it's like a phenomenon that few people in the world had the opportunity to see. And once you film really well and you go after answers with scientists and everything, people can get to understand what they are. You usually have to go far from, from the town up to the mountains and uh, you need um, low light sensitive camera. And uh, what else you need? Ah, you need good equipment, good gear for the cold. Because in the regions where you see Northern Lights, it's very, very cold. So temperatures can go up to minus 35. So you need uh, good gear and you need to set up your camera before you go out. The Northern Lights are the result of collisions between the Earth's gas particles and matter released by the sun's atmosphere. The collisions can jar the magnetosphere around the Earth's north and south poles, releasing colourful streams into the sky. It can often take Matos and Paul hours of driving their snowmobiles in extreme terrain and Arctic conditions to find suitable spots away from the town where there is no light pollution.